Hey everybody, PC Outcast here, back with more Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And there's a bunch of Iraq ghouls right over there. That's unfortunate now that we have no... Now that we have no, uh... No Candorous backing us up. Okay, you guys. Hey, hey, yeah, one, one. Come right here. There you go. Well done. <laughs> Oh, nice. Down you go! I guess you're going down there. Oh, good. Up, oh, stop, just disengage. Kill this guy. Oh, nice. Well, that's... That's fine. You know, if we just blast them away, that's... That's okay with me. Just die on it! Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, oh, let's not aggro them all at the once. Okay. Can we not do that? Nice. And um, you um, that oh oh that's a fiend. Let's take that one. Nice. And last one. Oh, wrecking them. Wow. Who's this? Outcast Corpse. Um, Promised Land Apprentice Journal. Ah, there you go. Is it in here? Seth Papers. Promised Land Apprentice Journal. Not usable. Can I look at it, at it here? No, I gotta return that. So if I want to read it, I gotta read it right here. This journal details the search for the promised land carried out by Rakul's apprentice. Most of the entries are mundane. However, the last entry is quite interesting. I've uncovered evidence that others have been seeking out the fabled land and that their treks have led them into the sewers. I have decided that I must go there as well. So what was that, eh? Apparently there's a corpse over here. Now there's a frag mine. Corpse. The med pack. Skeletal corpse with computer spike and parts. And I don't think there's anything over here. No. Um, uh -huh. mission. How's your abilities as far as this is concerned. Mine I'm gonna try and pick it up. Don't get, don't get yourself blown up though. Nice. What? Yeah, her skill's obviously a little bit higher. Certainly higher than mine. Okay, so I've covered all of this. This is the sewers. That's the village gate. The bazaar. I mean, we can just carry on into the sewers, or I can go back and sell some things, maybe? We got two antidote kits, maybe some more antidote kits would be a good idea. We don't got no Rackgull serum, but did I search this? I probably did. No, there's more over here that we haven't actually explored. Hey, that is one of the things. Yeah? One of the so they mined it after after checking out what was here? It really caused quite a bit of damage. And I crashed. There's a guy over there. We're gonna have to get into a fight or something. Or is or is he injured? Ready. Oh, wrong sure. Guy. Republic soldier. Help. Help me. Please. I I can feel it inside my skin. Something growing. Like some kind of hideous disease. Uh-oh. -uh. Well, there's nothing I can do to help him. I'm sorry, but there's nothing I can do for you. 
I'll help you, but I need information first. Sure. No! No! I can see that! Ah! Wow, they like magically transform. <laughs> Crazy. Sorry, dude. I really apologize. Don't suppose you have anything. You, you just transformed. You were carrying a blaster and things. Fine. Fine. Just rob me of my rightful loot. See if I care. Did I go over here? No, oh, that is a Sith Patrol leader. Okay, well maybe just save that. In case things go horribly wrong. You there, civilian. This is a restricted area. What are you doing down here? Look, I got all the proper security papers. I don't like your tone. <laughs> You're questioning the Sith. How many people do we have to kill before the rest of you learn some respect? Well, I guess it's time for another lesson. Patrol! Hey, cool. Might get some good gear out of this guy. Oh, wow, that was quick. Can we, can we actually get any chance? Uh, hit him, please? Stop missing. Good grief. Uh, bad time. Time to wow, he's really good at dodging. Let's go. He's one of these days I'll make contact. I can like nobody's able to hit him or do any damage to him at all. Finally. An advanced med pack, frag grenades, Sith energy shield, blaster rifle, and motion detection goggles. Nice. And some other good stuff. And some other good stuff. What is missions gear like? She's got a blaster pistol. Can probably give her something slightly better than that. Oh, she's got uh, a vibro blade. Yeah. Take your vibro blade, girl. You got a stealth generator, too, which is nice. Um. Yeah. Cool. Although, it was kind of. She's doing pretty good. Uh, just, you know, shooting things up. Okay, we got some more rack ghouls over there. Anything over here? Separate these out. Here are you. Come, come towards me. There you go. You'll never get me. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, I got poison. There now. I am. What I want to do. One of those. Drink it. I guess it's a hy it's like a hypo spray thing. What, what is this? Is this anything? Doesn't seem like anything. There we go. Oh, why do you want to constantly talk, Karth? Yes. What's on your mind? <sighs> I just want to talk with you. You know, because you're just such a joy. Oh, you want to argue some more? Is that it? Yeah. So I've seen. If I were Malik, I'd be a bit nervous to have you on my tail. I just don't trust easily. And for good reasons. Which are my own. But we have to work together, man. What reasons? <laughs> Stuff your reasons. <laughs> oh, damn it. I suppose I won't get any rest until I talk, will I? You want to know why I don't trust anyone? Fine. Here goes. Five years ago, the Jedi had just finished the war with the Mandalorians. Revan and Malak were heroes. 
I was damn proud to have served in their fleet. It was completely unexpected when they turned on us, invading the Republic while we were still weak. Nobody knew what to think, least of all me. Our heroes had become brutal, conquering Sith. And we were all but helpless before them. I mean, think about it. If you can't even trust the best of the Jedi, who can you trust? What do I have to do with Revan and Malak? Or Malak, Malak and Revan? They turn to the dark side, obviously. Why is it so personal? Uh, of course the Jedi turned to the dark side. <coughs> there were others, however, who weren't Jedi. Good men, trusted men, who joined them. Malak and Revan and the Sith deserve to die for what they've done. But the ones who fled the Republic and joined them are even worse. The dark side has nothing to do with why they joined with the Sith. They deserve no mercy. Huh. You say that with such hatred. I know. I'm... And I should apologize to you. I I've, feel I've become so accustomed to expecting God. the worst in others, God. and you've done nothing to deserve that. It's just... No, never mind. Let's just continue with what we were doing. I'd rather not talk about it. But well, stop kicking off these discussions, man. Here, chuck a grenade over there. Enjoy. Uh, that did not take any damage. Oh boy. Did any, did any of these things take any damage? You asked for this! Okay, you're done. Nice. That's another fiend. Oh. Yeah, just wreck them. 300 XP! Wow! Wow! Can I not search that? No. Got a skeletal corpse again. And a Sith soldier corpse. Rakul Serum. Blaster. Blaster rifle, heavy combat suit, a beam splitter, and antidote. Nice. Very nice. Very, very nice indeed. Oh. How do you like that? Let's see. Mission. Can you equip the heavy combat suit? Good. And we got the Rakul Serum, which is pretty yes. cool. We can sell that to Davik for a thousand coin. Hey, Car. You're a pilot for the Republic, right? You've been all over the galaxy, I bet, right? So tell me, how would you rate Taurus compared to other worlds you've seen? To be honest, Mission, Taurus would rate pretty low. Prejudice, the rich spoiling themselves while the poor are crushed beneath them. It's not a pretty picture. Yeah, but that's only since the Sith occupation. Before that, well, I guess it wasn't all that different, really. Hmm. Maybe Taurus ain't as great as I thought, you know? Trust me, Mission, there are a lot of worlds better than Terrace. There, there are worse, too, but Terrace is no place for a kid to live on her own. Even a kid who's got a Wookiee to look out for. Hey, I ain't no kid. I look out for Zalbar as much as he looks out for me. Bixie's my friend, not my babysitter. Jeez, I come ask you a question, you give me a lecture. Don't you snap at me, Missy. You want a lecture? How's this? Only bratty little children fly off the handle because of a simple comment. <laughs> Good grief. You're not gonna take that from him, are you, Mission? I don't have to listen to you, Karth. You ain't my father, though you're sure old enough to be. So keep your lectures inside your withered old head. Because I don't need them. And I sure as hell don't need this. Look, let's just drop it and get back to what we were doing. <laughs> oh, good times. <sighs> All right. So we, I guess we're going to the village gate. Because we've done everything else. And we save the day. I can't thank you enough for saving me, Upworlder. If I had anything but these rags on my back, it would be yours. But we have nothing. I still have you, Hendar. That's all I need. Let's go back to the village. Thank you for saving Hendar. You are braver than you I, Upworlder. You closed my friends out on the other Maybe side. Maybe the outcasts have lived too long in selfish fear. Perhaps we can learn a lesson from your brave actions. <laughs> but enough of my ramblings. Is there something you need, Upworlder? Um, who are you? I'm Trellin, from the Outcast Village. 
It's my job to guard the gates. You see, they are locked to protect us from the rat ghouls. Can I ask you some questions? I just guard the gates. Gendar is the leader of the village, Upworlder. You should speak to him if you have any questions. Okay. Goodbye, Upworlder. That was not very helpful. Okay, Agir. Agir. Hey there, Upworlder. You. Yep. Give me. Maybe give me some stuff. stuff. Whatever. What can I sell you? Well, I can sell you some clouds that are completely worthless, and some blaster pistols, and some rifles. Got a bunch of uh, that stuff. I keep forgetting to use these things. Oh, I can sell the mines. I'm not going to use them. Or, you know, they might come in handy. I don't know. Got the Achani battle armor. Got a core staff. That's too weak. Yeah, I don't. I don't think that there's really... Like, I don't think I can put this. I need uh, implant level 2 to use that. Alright. Well, nothing really. Um, what have we got? Got the rack cool thingy. We got the journal. I don't know if we're coming back through here, so I guess I'll just tell... Rakul, Rak, Rak, Raki, Rukil. Greetings once more, Upworlder. About his apprentice's journal. Do you bring news of my apprentice? Have you discovered her fate and proved yourself to be a true savior of my people? Uh, sure. Your apprentice is dead. Here's her journal. It is as I feared, then. She joins the list of those who have given their lives in the service of our cause. But though I am saddened by this news, there is yet hope. By finding my apprentice, you have proved yourself worthy, Upworlder. You are to be the beacon on our path to salvation. You will guide us to the promised land. What? I don't know where it is. I think you have me confused with someone else. Hold on a second. I'm not getting, guiding anybody anywhere. You are marked, Upworlder. Even my dim old eyes can see the mantle of destiny that cloaks you. Perhaps old Rukil knows you better than you know yourself. I am old. I have lived a hundred years in the Undercity, cast down into the darkness. I know the legends and history of our people, and now you must learn it too. I'm not interested. I offer you wisdom, and you turn me away. Perhaps you are not ready to accept the role you must play in the destiny and salvation of my people. Very well, Upworlder. Return to me when you are ready to learn what you must learn. Sure, man. Whatever. Okay. Um, anything else? Right. I don't actually know where Largo or Daya are. I got the Rackles here in them. Well, let's see if we can save, uh, is it Zalbar or whatever? Find him, then Mission can show us how to get into the Valkar base and on and on. Okay, where's the nearest spot? That's the escape pod. There's the sewers. Right over here. I mean, so far so good, right? Kind of kicking, kicking butt of those, with those rat ghouls. Mine second, yes. What? Uh, go get that mine. What? Rat ghouls! I see rat ghouls. That killed one. You kill him. Ah. 
Hey, buddy. Dude, friend. Take that. Let's go. Okay, can I search him? No. Oh, that's too bad. Okay. Hey. Mission, can you what? go in there and. Uh, oh! Get that. Awesome. Yes. Thank you very much. Have cast corpse. Another promised land journal. An arrested droid. Ooh, I can uh, I can activate this. I got a lot of spikes and stuff. Um, hang on. Wait a minute. What's everybody's skills? I think I need intelligence, right? For uh. You've got 13 intelligence. You have 14 intelligence. Okay, you probably can get this thing up and running a lot better than I can. Uh, engage its patrol mode. Activate its shields. Sure. Engage its patrol mode. Sure. Gonna go over there, and I don't know. Maybe go beat some things up or s beat someone up. We'll just join in here. Uh, sonic grenade, cryo band, frag. Check. Frag grenade at him. Oh, you. <laughs> Somebody just leveled up. Oh, sweet. Just keep killing them. That's the chief. Get him. Oh, sweet. He's dead too. Nice. Skill. Cardio regulator. Anything else? Sorry, you're trying to get through here, are you? There's a uh, bag here. Oh, whoa. Well. Look at this. This is one of those old style manual locks. No computer code to nothing. The sewers is the only place you can see one of these on terrace. There's an attack hey, going on. But don't worry. I've come across them before. I've rigged up a little device that should do the trick. Holy mackerel. Alright, uh, Zalbar, come on and join us. I'm glad to see you too, Big Z. You didn't think I'd forget about you. Mission and Zalbar, together forever. Who's that with you? These are my new friends, Big Z. Without them, I could never have got you out. Good to meet you, Zalbar. Don't mention I was happy to help. So is there some kind of reward for free? You know the language of my people? That is rare among your species. I'm impressed. You saved me from a life of servitude and slavery. There is only one way I can ever repay such an act. I will swear a life debt to you. A life debt? You sure about that, Big Z? Think about it carefully. Better be sure about this. I'm sure, Mission, this is an issue of great importance to me because of our great physical strength, while these are being used to slave labor on our, home world, on our own homeworld. They see us as brutes and animals to be exploited. Over the years, slavers have taken many of my people. We must always be on guard against raids against our villagers. When the Gamorians captured me, I thought I was doomed to a life of servitude. I have been saved from such a fate, and the only way I can repay that is through a life debt. Whoops. Um, Big Z, swearing a Wookiee life debt to you? Wow, this is major. Do you realize what this means? Let me guess, it means I have a walking carpet following me around for the rest of my days. Hey, don't make fun of the life debt. This is serious business, you know? A life debt is the most solemn vow a Wookiee can make. It means he'll stay by your side for the rest of your life. 
Wherever you go, whatever you do, Zalbar will be with you. In the presence of you all, I swear my life death. Forever after, I will be on your side. Be by your side, Zavasha Press. May my vow be as strong as the roots of the great Roshar trees of Kashak. I'm honored. I don't want a Wookiee following me around all the time. I suppose there's no way I can get out of this. Sorry, but there's not much you can do about it. Zalbar's already sworn the life debt, and it's not something they can just take back. This is a sacred, irreversible vow. I guess this means you're stuck with me, too. Wherever Big Z goes, I'm going. I almost lost him once. It's not going to happen again. Great, a Wookiee and a snot nose punk. Why won't this nightmare end? Hey, don't underestimate. I may be young, but I'm quick and plenty smart. You just give me a chance and you'll be surprised how useful I can be. So, I guess I still owe you one secret path into the Volca base. That was the deal, wasn't it? Don't worry. I know a backdoor into that scum den. Good. Let's just get there. Just tell me how to get there. I better come with you. The Volkers put up a force shield to keep the sewer dwellers out. I'm one of the only non volkers on Terrace who can get you past it. I can't remember exactly how to get there, but I know it was somewhere here in the sewers. Over to the northeast, if I remember right. I just hope the Rancor monster isn't still there. A Rancor? Are you serious? I'm spoiling for a fight. You did a good job mopping up those Gamorians, but I don't think you want to take on a Rancor. Those things are huge. Luckily, Rancors aren't too bright. I was able to sneak past it before, so I'm sure we'll figure something out. That is, unless you want to change your mind. It's not really an option. Let's go. Okay, then. Off we go. Like I said, somewhere to the southeast. Just look for the force shield, and we'll know we're there. All bars joined your party. Switch parties, blah, 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 blah. Left click. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay, so I can choose him if I want. Um, sure, instead of the annoying Karth, I'll just go with that. Okay, let's, you level up. Ooh, constitution 20, strength 20, nice. And auto level you up. What can I do for you as far as gear is concerned? Can't wear the motion goggles. You can wear the cardio regulator. That is an extra two fortitude. Do I want that though? Adrenaline amplifier gives me plus two reflex, plus two forti fortitude. Higher fortitude. So what does that give me? Like more strength? More. This is making me basically harder to hit, I would imagine. Let me try switching over to that. Fortitude. Fortitude. Oh, pardon me. Fortitude, reflex, and will. Well, whatever. And I can also do the motion goggles. That gives me... This is plus two will. This gives me plus two awareness, demolition, and security, which is kind of useless. Um, I should be able to put her on the... I don't know. Did I... Ah! Did I, did I switch over accidentally? I don't want that. What happened to my... I guess I want that off. You? Yes, yeah, she put the neural on. Put, you put this on, and I will put that back on. How about that? Okay, that's gonna give her more, even more skill at, you know, breaking things and whatever. Okay, he also killed these guys for me. Thank you, little robot guy. Huh? Can she break this? Oh, she can. Nice. Gotcha. Simple. Zelbar's bowcaster suite, and some Pazak cards, and a scope, and some grenades. Sure. Take all that. You can get your bowcaster. 
Very nice. You can also take the adrenaline amplifier, I guess. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. What? That's another sword arc thing. Um, that is the Undercity. That is a force field. This is something. Yeah. Let me open that up, of course. Got you. What? Simple. Oh boy. Um, can you kind of run what? back? Yes. What? How come that didn't set it off? Sure. Whole bunch of junk. Okay, that's the other side of that. There's nothing out actually in there, right? I think so. More rack ghouls, uh oh. Hmm. Nice. You kill that thing. Oh wow. And rack. Yeah. Alright. I kind of feel like I need to go back, though. There's a lot more to this, this place, so we'll continue on in the next episode. Thanks very much for joining me. We'll see you then.